All right, we all got four cards laid out so far. So I got isolation reversed, humiliation reversed, cold reversed, and then I got chasing reversed. So Leo, it's either y'all take what side y'all on. Somebody is trying to avoid somebody. And it's like, at the same time, whoever is trying to avoid that person, I feel like you don't want to feel... I'm here stupid or feel like a fool. Put it like that. You don't want to feel like a fool for, you know, going back to this person. But on the other side, your person, they know you avoiding them. And they feel like they don't want to be embarrassed about coming back towards you. Because I feel like some of y'all, they know that you are avoiding them and isolating yourself from them. But at the same time, like I said, your person wants to come back, but they don't want to like, they, basically they feel guilty about something that they did. You see what I'm saying? You trying to avoid this person or even isolate yourself from this person, but it's like they want to come back, but at the same time, you know what I'm saying? It's like the guilt. They don't want to, basically, they don't want to own up to what they have done. Even though they know they feel guilty, it's like they don't want to, they don't want to own up to what they have done to you. You see what I'm saying? But at the same time, they want to come out of the cold. Like, literally. So it's like, one, okay, rewind. Y'all could be avoiding somebody, right? The other person want to come back, but at the same time, they too embarrassed to come back. But at the same time, again, they tired of feeling left out in the cold because it's like you're not reaching out, Leo. Since they feel like you're not reaching out to them first, they're not going to reach out to you. But at the same time, they they tired of feeling like, you know, they, they tired of you not contacting them, basically. So y'all both is playing, y'all mirroring each other in a way. You trying to get away because you don't want to be a fool. They try to isolate themselves because they don't want to feel guilty about what they have done. You know what I'm saying? And hold accountability for what they have done. Although, they're tired of being isolated from you and not hearing from you. Because we got cold and then we got chasing. But at the same time, like I said, they want to come back, but they don't want to chase you. Y'all both two stubborn-ass individuals, Leo. It's like, like, it's crazy. Toxic relationship. Some of y'all... This person could be, y'all could be avoiding this person because y'all are in a relationship that's toxic. Or they may have ghosted you because, you know, they was in a relationship with somebody else, which was a toxic relationship. I feel like this is more of them being in another relationship, but it was toxic. Look, back to X. I knew it. Somebody went back to somebody else that they was more familiar with. This is somebody that they in a toxic relationship with. Yeah, it was, they felt more comfortable in that situation with that person and I just feel like the ex holding on to them too but at the same time it's like they want to come back to you but they don't want to apologize either or they want to they don't want to own up to what they did basically they don't want to reach out first they want you to reach out first you see what I'm saying clear intuitive messages although they in a toxic ass relationship with somebody else Your person holding on to both of y'all. It's like energetically, Leo, they holding on to you. But physically, they holding on to their ex. Although they want to come back to you. This person could be confused about who they want, Leo. Because we got confused right here. And hell, maybe at one point in time, they was confusing the both of y'all. If they stuck in the middle. But I just felt like this person is confused about... Like, you could have this person wondering for real. They don't know where they stand with you, Leo. Whatever, look, they feel like you got beef with them. Some of y'all feel, this person feels like, not only you mad at them, but they feel like maybe they stirred up some drama or something. Or something happened between y'all where y'all had a little, like, an argument or something. But some of y'all, this person feels like you got beef with them, like you mad at them or something about something they said or did, clear into the message, that's why you haven't reached out, but at the same time, I'm getting this energy Leo, for the good Leos I'm talking about, 
y'all could be like purposely avoiding this person because of what they have done to you and you don't want to look stupid or be stupid by reaching out to somebody that did that to you you see what i'm saying so it's like yeah maybe there is beef or maybe there is some form of resentment on your your end but some of y'all's person feel like you do got beef with them because of um of you not reaching out clear into the messages please grief but it's reversed some of y'all may have been recently grieving over this person but i feel like most of y'all already got over this person like you're not grieving over this person anymore you see what i'm saying but i am seeing that some of y'all this person could be struggling with the with with the loss of you i am getting that because grief reverse don't even mean that i don't even have to be this is like the five of cups so it's like it don't even have to be that you got over the grief. On your end, I feel like y'all have got over the grief. But on their end, I just feel like they have a hard time letting go of the law the, of, of losing you with grief reverse. You see what I'm saying? Which is the past, which is you. Because we got beef right here. They still, this is like the five of wands. It's like, or yeah, the five of wands. It's like they battling with themselves emotionally about you walking away or and you leaving them behind. That's what I'm getting intuitively. Like, for real. And, like I said, most of y'all could be avoiding this person. I'm getting a strong avoidance with this person, Leo, on your end. But the other person, it's like they want to come back, but they don't want to own up to what they did. They don't want to feel, they don't want to apologize or none of that. They want you to be stupid enough to reach out to them first. And I just feel like your person is being stu stubborn as hell and having a hard time owning up to accountability. I am seeing that. Although they're in a relationship with somebody else, with an ex, you know, you're confusing the hell out of this person, to be honest. Some of y'all's person don't even know if you, like I said, if you healed from this situation, if you got over it or not. They just don't know. Cold, trash, reverse. But somebody's getting ready to come out of the cold. I feel like it's them. Clear intuitive messages. Or this could be you, your energy. Maybe this could, you could be coming out of the cold. Because you don't know what's going on with this person. And you haven't spoke to this person. They haven't reached out to you. So, you know, maybe you're just tired of them not reaching out to you. And you you getting ready to, you know, come back. Y'all take what applies. Mixed signals. I feel like your person really knows what it is that they want see they come from being confused and then underneath it to make signals reverse to not being confused so like i said your person really figured something out they realize you wasn't chasing their ass that's what that is they know that you're not chasing them rebound reverse yeah you could be rejecting this person from coming back in your life because you're not an option you're not a rebound like I said, y'all could be isolating yourself from this person, avoiding this person. You know, because you don't want to be stupid to, like, reach out to this person after they what they did to you. You feel like this person owe you an apology. Some of y'all feel like this person owe you an apology and they need to confess and own up to what they have done to you. You're not about to kiss this person ass. That's the energy that I'm picking up on. Some of y'all this person could be wanting to have makeup sex with you. They want to make up with you. They want to see you, Leo. So not only they want to make up with you, they want to see. They want to see you. They want to make up with you, have sex with you. Like it's like whatever y'all had going on between this person, they want to squash it and just have makeup sex. They way of getting over of losing you, Leo, is by having makeup sex. You see what I'm saying? Instead of holding accountability, they rather have makeup sex with you. I feel like this is in their mind because most of y'all are isolating yourself and y'all. You know, you, you're you not a rebound. you looking at yourself as not like that. You know, you're not taking this person back. Some of y'all feel that way. Yeah, you're not fighting for this person's attention. I'm seeing a lot of avoidance with y'all, Leo. I'm seeing a lot of avoidance. Most of you guys I'm talking about have already healed from this person. You see what I'm saying? Clear, intuitive messages. Now, you feel like this. you're not fighting for this. And I feel like they ain't trying to do it either. It's crazy. It's like they don't want to put the effort in. They don't want to own up to what they did. They don't want to be a man or be the woman to take that step and apologize. Just apologize and own up to what you did. And that's crazy how stubborn this person is. It's like y'all got every right to hold back. But for them, it's like they don't want to like, they don't want to like, like I said, be a man about it. I'm hearing be a man about it. Like, that's crazy. It's sad.
clear intuitive messages. Okay, we got, hold on, there's too many right here, but I am going to take the first ones out. Let me use this. Hey, if fam will reverse. So, some of y'all family did have something to do with this, whether this is on your end or their end. But some of y'all, this person, they family didn't want to want y'all to be together, like a sister or a mom or something. And that's probably why they was forced to go back and deal with their ex. With me, with their ex. Wow, but I feel like they leaving them out of the situation. They getting them out of their business for some reason. They getting them out of that out of their business now. It's like they at first maybe when y'all dealing with each other or talking to each other, the family was involved in being nosy or whatever or had stuck their nose in, in y'all relationship or situation. Now it's like this time they not allowing the family to. I'm hearing fuck that up. Clear intuitive messages, please. But I feel like family is out of the picture. Karmic love and the karmic lover. So that maybe the karmic love is their family. Maybe it was a oh that back to ex that ex that they was dealing with that they was living with. Maybe that um that is the same person. That person is out of the picture. I'm hearing. I'm hearing that person is out of the picture, and it was a karmic. It was a karmic. It's because your person loved you, Leo. Clear intuitive messages. And that's probably why they having a hard time facing you because some of y'all, this is somebody that not used to opening up to people or not used to apologizing to people because they so used to getting what it is that they want from other people. It's like as soon as they meet you, you a whole different breed. Like you're not with that. You making this person step up. You forcing this person to step up. And that's what they don't want to do because like I said, they are used to getting their way from other people. And you ain't with that shit. That's the energy that I'm picking up on. Clear, intuitive messages. Law and order. Some of y'all this person may have, maybe they could be on like on probation or something, or maybe they could be on parole, but I am seeing that your person is getting ready to take the initiative and come towards you, Leo. They is. They gonna, now they're going to man up and be, I mean, I'm getting, this is like the, um, what is it, the emperor card. Or it could be the justice card. But at the same time, I just feel like they still going to come in and, and, and make it right with you. Because like I said, that ex situation that they was dealing with, they get they got rid of that person. It's either they did or they getting ready to get rid of this person. Because it was a karmic. And like I said, th the love lies with you. Because so, I feel like you are in control of the situation now. And they know that. Because you're not budging. You're not chasing them. You're not begging for them. You're not asking about them. You're not checking them. You know what I'm saying? They know you got the upper hand. They know in order for them to come and step up to you, they're going to have to come correct. And they're going to have to apologize for what they have done. Clear intuitive messages, please, for my beautiful Leos. I don't think I'm supposed to take that one. This one says, side piece, sneaky link. Some of y'all, this person has a side piece. Or they had one. Ooh, I'm hearing that, okay. If they was in a relationship with an ex, right? Because I am clearly seeing that. They may have to go to court because of that person. I'm seeing three people on the end. Like them and two other people. So it's like not only they had their ex, but I feel like they got rid of that person, their ex. But at the same time, they replaced their ex with another person. You see what I'm saying? So it's like it wasn't even just you or their ex. It, it was also another person involved. I'm clearly seeing that. So it's like they got rid of their ex already, right? And they started messing around with another person, which was a karmic. But they know that they love you. You see what I'm saying? But it's like the side piece that's left in a picture could be trying to control them in a way. We're going to see. We're going to see. Some of y'all be careful because this person could try to make you as a side piece. And that's probably why you're holding back because you know what they're about. You see what I'm saying? They may try to come in and pretend and shit. And control some shit. Knowing they already dealing with somebody else. Hmm. Family reverse. 
Oh, they got rid of that person too. Maybe their family didn't like them either. Yeah, they don't want to be with that side piece. Some of y'all, they didn't get rid of them. They just don't want them. They just don't want to be with them. They don't take these other people seriously, yo. I'm clearly seeing that. They don't take those third parties. The, the other people, they don't take them serious as they take you serious because you put your foot down. You walked away. But those other people, not at all. Not at all. Like, they don't even stand a chance with that person at all. Four of Wands Reverse. I told you, they don't want that person. They don't want that person. They leaving that person. We got the three of wands. Some of y'all, this person is watching you. They spying on you. They know you in control. Some of y'all got your own business, I'm seeing. Or you got a really nice job where you... Some of y'all work for the government. I'm also getting that somebody could work at the courthouse. But they know you are leveling up without them. Because they see it. And they know it. Maybe they, you told them what you do for a living. Maybe they are aware of that. But they see that you are leveling up behind the scenes. And they know that because you are you kept quiet right now, Leo. You kept quiet. Some of y'all, the person that they're dealing with, could be trying to propose to them, whether it's a man or a woman. But I don't see that. I feel like... You, you, this could just be your energy where they try, where I try to have, you know, get you back and propose to you and tell you how they really feel. Cause like I said, if they, they, they is going to be the man, be a man about it or a woman about it and come towards you. You know what I'm saying? Cause they see you doing good, but y'all, some of y'all need to be careful. Cause I feel like this person does have somebody else on the side, even though they could be saying they got rid of the other person, but somebody's getting ready to come in and express themselves. But most of y'all don't want nothing to do with them. Some of y'all, this could be um somebody you already got kids with. The rest of y'all, I am seeing they did get rid of that baby mom or baby dad. Whoever that ex situation already said that. I'm here. They trying to have you as a like a little side joint. Like literally, this is somebody who could be a whore, a player that has a lot of pride, a lot of ego, like. You see what I'm saying? But some of y'all don't want this person. Y'all could be letting this person go with the hangman reverse. Yeah. I'm hearing you think I'm stuck on stupid. Like, yeah, y'all could be rejecting this person. Some of y'all is. Some of y'all going to take this person back. We got the high priestess. Maybe you see right through this person. Some of y'all could be very psychic, I'm hearing. But most of y'all could be like really kept quiet and already got it in your mind that you left this person. Wow. Yeah, y'all gonna reject this person. Some of y'all feel like y'all gotta reject this person because their family didn't approve you. Because you feel like if they gonna reject you, if they family reject you, you don't want nothing to do with them. I am seeing that. You see what I'm saying? So, you just felt like since their family don't like you, you don't like them, you don't like neither one of them. And I feel like you're not telling this person. This is for those who ain't said nothing to this person yet. you just holding back. Doing your own thing. Why they... Sitting here seeing you level up. You see what I'm saying? But I'm going to go ahead and end it right here, Leo. I hope this resonates with you guys. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe. And y'all be blessed.